In today's episode of Oxygen Not Included, we are going to be reducing the colony back down to a reasonable level. It'll be the survival of the fittest. It'll be a battle royale. And for the duplicates that survive, they will have to build a rocket and launch themselves into the sun. Yes, this seems like a perfectly reasonable thing to do. Because if you're gonna go out, you better go out in a blaze of glory. In case you missed the last two episodes, we started off with 10 duplicates and gave them superpowers, and it was very effective. After that, Bob Ross dared me to drop 100 duplicates into the base, and we did so. And as you can see, it didn't really turn out all that good. So how is this going to work? Well, first off, we're going to deny access to this beautiful farm down here that took us about 40 duplicates to make. So yeah, all of that is for nothing. Now the food that we've already created, Yes, if you're smart enough, you will grab that food early on and be able to eat it. The way I'm denying access is by only letting the doors lead out. So if you're in there right now, you better grab something before you leave. As for the rest of the food around the map, if you pick it up, you can eat it or you can take it back and actually cook it into something useful. All recipes are forever. As for food, everything's on the table. If you can grab it, you can eat it. And the final ingredient to our challenge is the ability to dig the entire map. So just like this. Oh my, that's going to take forever. <sighs> yep, just waiting. <laughs> oh wow, it actually finished. I had given up hope. I had actually started to do other things. This took 30 minutes to queue up. All right, so now that I have everything queued up, you might be thinking, oh, maybe something's exposed to space. But you know what? I'm not going to wait another 30 minutes to click all of that again. What I'm going to do is hit save. And now I'm going to wait another 30 minutes. No. Nope. Now I know what you're thinking. Battle Royale games always start with 100 duplicates. Okay, uh, I mean 100 people. You're not actually duplicates, 100 people. And you're right, which means I'm gonna have to load this map again. You wanna see what happens when we click the priority tab? Oh, <laughs> it doesn't even work. Oh, there we go. So you might be thinking some of these duplicates might end up in a spot where they can't dig themselves to freedom. Well, I've put some freedom ladders in there and I've given those a higher priority. So maybe if the duplicates are smart, they will actually dig that and build the ladders first before they try to dig the rest of the map. If you're concerned about heat, well, I'm going to build a giant wall because giant walls fix everything. All right, so while this game is trying to load the main menu, I'm pretty sure I broke it. <laughs> oh, hmm, who'd have thought that? I was told in the comment section that there is a copy button. Aha, look at this, appearance, attributes, traits, skills. Beautiful, my goodness, I could have saved so much time. All right, so to give everybody a chance here, we're going to make everybody... What happens if we just give them all the traits? So yeah, maybe they're destructive. Maybe they're anemic. How about a caregiver? How about a binge eater? How about a bottomless stomach? Unconstructive gastopia. Tri... Oh, that isn't gonna work. Hold up. All right, so let's give them all the good traits here. Oh, and destructive, because that's gonna be fun. Yeah, let's make them all claustrophobic too. Click learner. We'll give them an iron gut. Let's make them all narcoleptic too. That'll be entertaining. Night owl, mm-hmm. So not only are they an early bird, they're also a night owl. I see nothing wrong with that. They just don't ever sleep. <laughs> they're buff and a rock crusher. Super strong. They're workaholics. We can't ever let them go idle. <laughs> That's not gonna be a problem. <laughs> this duplicate has simply no appreciation for the arts. Perfect. Simple tastes. Man, they got so many traits. Bunch of sunny disposition. Perfect. Oh, that's a, that's gonna be nice. So there we have it. All the beautiful traits. Now, as for the skills, uh, we definitely need mining because otherwise we're not gonna be able to dig all the stuff we need to dig. And we might as well have medicine too because that's gonna be good. And just to make things fair, they're also going to have cooking. So there we have it. That's our default duplicate. So if I say copy, um, not appearance, but attributes, traits, and skills, copy, and then paste. Aha! Oh, that's faster. So nice. Honestly, this could have saved me so much time had I known it was here. Ugh! Oh, well, at least I didn't have to do it twice. Okay, so now we need an extra 41 duplicates, and since rumor has it I figured out how to clone myself, 
I'm just going to clone myself. All right, so that is a job well done. <laughs> wow, this save game takes 10 minutes to load. I'm so glad I'm recording this at 60 frames per second because we're managing one at the moment. One. At least the mouse is smooth. How about that? That's that's one pot. <laughs> oh. What? It, there's like this weird texture that's going on here. Clone of Meepgar. Okay, let's see if we can find Meepgar real quick. Because he's probably going to spawn just a ton of clones right on top of him. Look. Oh, the leg! Holy mo- Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh no! Oh no, the game! What is even happening? I'm, I'm running this slow. No, you can't go in there. You can only go out. Okay, let, let me zoom out here and see what's happening. Oh my gosh. This is so broken. All right, so right off the bat, the clone army has unleashed a massive puddle of polluted water here. And is drowning everything out. By the way, let's get some buddy plants up in these. Uh, uh, come on. We can do it. Okay, let's take a look at the reports real quick. Chores. 79,000. That's how many we added here. <laughs> uh, that ought to do it. Okay, who's suffocating? Mima? Zoom India. Where you at? You're gone. You're not even there. We'll follow Super Meep here. Come on, buddy. Oh, there he goes. The game can't even keep up with him. <laughs> oh! Yeah, literally, the camera does not keep up with him. It falls behind. The feast! This is your last meal. Oh my gosh, it's savage. It's... Look at this. Are you kidding me? All of that food... Gone. Alright, so just out of curiosity... Um... We're nearly at 6 gigs... For RAM on Oxygen Not Included. <laughs> oh, hey, look, we can print something. Hmm, bristleberries. Look at them all. They're all sleeping in the exact same spot. By the way, thank you for subscribing, Roy, and everybody else that's been subscribing recently. Alright, so one thing I think I should do here is just prepare for death. Uh, I think it's going to happen. Build tiles, you can do it. I can't even queue stuff. Surprisingly, nobody's died yet. Like... I am sufficiently kind of surprised that nobody has died yet. There are definitely stuck duplicates. As we can see, the clone of Meepgars down here are having a very thoughtful moment next to this piece of rock. Uh, while that one's just sleeping on the job. Here we go. Let's clone up a bunch of this. We're going to need these tasteful memorials. We're nearing 100% stress here. Otto looks like he's going to be the first one to go. Um... Yeah, I definitely can't click on him at this... <laughs> the poor game! It can't... It's so broken at the moment. Well, actually, it's not broken, surprisingly. Even though there's this massive <laughs> traffic jam going on. <laughs> oh, wow. I'm sorry, Clay. I'm destroying your game. And I'm sorry, computer. I'm destroying you, too. <laughs> oh, no! We got a, de a death. Our first death. Harold. Oh, you were entombed. Sorry, buddy. Found yourself on the wrong side of the wall. Dude, these dupes... I, I thought I gave them all the ability to dig that. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please. Please don't. Skill points available. Minus five. Yeah, that seems legit. See the clone of Meepgars? They all... Yeah, yeah. This is, this is perfectly fine. Nothing wrong here. This area seems to have the most action going on. <laughs> Everybody's just falling. The game hasn't gotten around to figuring out that they're actually on the ground. Oh, man. Now, we have lots of suffocating. Interesting. They're all suffocating at the exact same spot. Okay, we're going to need to close this in. There's so much piss. Man, this game is really, really struggling. I think Liam's got the right idea down here. He's just sleeping. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna let everybody else go out there and die while I stay in bed. Good idea. This Liam up here, he's just completely confused. He has no idea. He's just like, huh. I wonder how this door works. Ha! Oh, this is the hot spot. Oh, except for somebody who got pissed off. I think he's trying to break stuff. No. See, all we gotta do is look at the power. They always go for the power first. Not always, but that's usually a, 
an early target. All right, well, let's try to speed the game up. <laughs> oh, no. Somebody else died. Turner, how did you die right there? What? Out of all the places you could have possibly died, that's your spot. Oh, there we go. Another one bites the dust. Otto, you found yourself next to the natural gas geyser. That's unfortunate. By the way, yeah, definitely no downtime. There's really no point. Okay, never mind. I guess there is a some point. Mmm, Catan. Yeah, you're done for. You dug too close to a wall. Oh, there we go. Four down. But look on the bright side. It's all the same debuff. Doesn't matter if one or ten die. It's all the same. Besides, look at all these nice, uh, tasteful memorials you got. And by the looks of all the flooding pee, death might be preferable. Wait, who's beating up on stuff? Uh, wait, Frankie! Oh, come on, man, that's our oxygen supply. What are you doing here, bud? Turner's trying to talk you out of it. I don't even think he broke anything, though. These duplicants might be so skilled that when they break something, they repair it at the exact same time. All right, what'd that tile ever do to you? Nothing. Apparently. Guess you're not done yet. <laughs> yeah, apparently. <laughs> These duplicants, even though they get stressed out and beat up equipment, they actually don't destroy it. I mean, it could be down to the fact that this game is just heavily overtasked at the moment. Um, what was yesterday's reports? Oh, we, we did get 1,263 done. Oh, wait, Ari's actually not done with that tile. She has to go yet another round. So the cooking of food, by the way, is set to like priority level nine. So if they do find food, they will cook food. Guess what? We're up to 6,500 megabytes. Woo! Cranking it up. So it seems like most of the work is going on right up here and right down there. And then a lot of duplicates are traveling from here to there. So, I mean, that's where we stored most of the material. So the stress is kind of bad in the base. Everybody's at 100%. <laughs> I've got, um, oh, a lot of people slashing out all of a sudden. This seems to be the most popular spot to beat up. This poor tile. I don't know what it ever did to anybody, but... <laughs> There's three of them attacking the thing. What? Okay, so it's that tile. Oh my gosh! What is... <laughs> no way! This diffuser is getting obliterated. But then they have to stop to take in air. <laughs> <laughs> and then they, once they catch their breath, finally, they start beating up on it again. Who's incapacitated? May, I think you're done for. Just reaching for that ladder. I don't think you're ever going to get to it. Oh, come on. Nope, not quite. And your last thought is about food. Hmm, I know the feeling. I kind of feel like we should mop around the bathrooms, don't you? There's a little bit of, um... Almost too much fluid up there. There we go. We'll give them some more stuff to do. Previous cycle, how much did we get done? 1,281. That's fairly consistent. I don't know how anybody's gonna sleep with all this pounding going on, though. Liam! Oh, not, the, not this Liam. Nope. This one right here. My money's on that Liam. He knows what's up. All he's doing is sleeping. Speaking of which, how's his stress? Yeah, compared to everybody else, it's not bad. 72%. Lyra! Mmm, die digging the ladder. That's unfortunate. Ooh, a couple of some sand there, unfortunately, did her in. Ari? Where you at, Ari? Ooh, they're starting to drop fast now. Bubbles, gone. Camille, also gone. I think Hazan's, no, wait. Who's dead over here? Congratulations, we've passed over 6,500 megabytes in memory. And we keep climbing. I'm gonna shut down that Google Chrome to free up some memory space. <laughs> just, to, just to keep the game going. All right, we got a little bit of floral sense going on. That's good, because I planted the little buddy bud. That should help with the germs a little bit. So long as nobody destroys them. Try to get another one over here. Come on. Mima, starved to death. Joshua, starved to death on the toilet. Oh, copy of Meepgar is going for the kill. Look at this. If he destroys this tile, all of these dupes up here will be trapped in the poopers. Could you imagine being stuck in a toilet? 
until you starve to death. What a crappy way to go. Okay, wow, all right. We've taken it up a notch. <laughs> all right, let's just see how many we have here. Hold up, hold up. One, two, three, four. It goes off the map, I don't know. There's, there, there's more. There are definite spots where these duplicates just go to relieve their stress. These two oxygen diffusers, the tile right next to it, and they just kind of pound their head on that tile, and this one right over here. They'll constantly beat on that thing forever. I don't know why none of the other tiles or machines get any love, but nope, that's what it's all about. I mean, I take that back. There's actually like tiles missing here. There's one missing there, there's one missing there. Oh, the attempt on the bathrooms failed. It's still there. Oh, two died. Frankie. Wow, dude. You ended up down here? That's a bad spot. And Ellie died. Hmm. This isn't good for the standard dupes. I think the clones are winning at this point. But they are digging towards some food. That might be good. If they can get there. Here, we'll send everybody out to attack these poor pups. They don't even know what's going to happen to them. Oh, they found the mushrooms. Oh no, who got it? The clones got it. One of the clones got it. Oh, but they're able to attack the puff and poof, it's all about the food. But here's the problem. They are now in this area down here, but they cannot get out. Okay, so at this point, I'm also going to queue up that we can attack any creature on the map. And in case I haven't done it already, everybody can harvest everything. It can't be that many items, can it? Three more down. Lyra, starve to death. Ari, starve to death. Ada, star, starve to death. Surprisingly, nobody's died of like suffocations and stuff. However, we got the clone of Meeps up here. They've ended up in a bad spot. That may be a triple threat that gets removed. You never know. They went for the food, but did they go too fast? Oh, it's, that was a bad move. Clone of Meepgars, you went for the food. Then you got stuck. Now you don't have any oxygen. Womp, womp, womp. Oh my goodness, everybody's dying. Oh! 10 died just like that. Oh, make that 11, 12. Oh! Just when the clones were in the lead, they start dying off. Oof, even more. Look at that, they're all over the place. I don't even know what's happening here. But. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's me! No! Okay, so what's behind the portal here? Mm, gold amalgam. That's not going to help anybody. There is 7,000 calories up for grabs if anybody can get their hands on it. The oxygen supply is under constant attack, as we can see here. <laughs> All four of them are constantly destroyed. More clones are kicking the bucket here. Oh my goodness, some of them are on the bucket too. Not sure what happened. You know, I feel like the priority on on moving the dead here is not high enough. <clears throat> or the fallen, I should say. Moving the fallen. There we go. Oh. Error occurred. Please restart game. <laughs> oh, no, not good. You know, I don't think that's going to load. All right, well, I went and took a shower in the amount of time that it took to load this map up again. Oh, bristleberries. Welcome. That'll be nice. Hassan! Not the grill! Anything but the grill! No! And it's fixed. Oh, time to beat it up again. Hassan! Not the grill! <laughs> oh, he even got a thumbs up while he's doing it. Well, I'm not so sure about these cloned meat guards. Oh, look at this! Look at this! Somebody successfully destroyed the tile that leads to all the bathrooms. And has managed, <laughs> has managed to trap three duplicates. Never mind, they can jump out. Their effort was in vain. Honestly, there's a gold mine of food right here. I mean, it's even in carbon dioxide. How's the oxygen situation doing? You know what? I'm surprised there's still oxygen that's around. That's pretty good, that's pretty good. This actually is really good down here. Of course, uh, it should be, considering what I'm, what I'm doing down there. Oh no! Crap! I'm gonna report the crash though. Sorry, Clay, good luck with this one! Okay, so attempt three. Um, at this point... Uh... 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 
Yeah, I'm just gonna disable all that. All right, so I've got a theory that the tasteful memorials are causing the crash. So rather than kindly bury everybody in a nice memorial, we're just gonna leave the corpses strewn across the map. Um, we could try to fix them later. Maybe. Oh man, everybody's just dying at the same time now. Yeah, we're just gonna put this on forever for all of the eggs, by the way. I mean, just in case. Y you never know. Ah, oh, that's six more. Hmm, there's a lot of them right here. This seems to be a very dangerous pit. <laughs> well, we got another one of these. When they die on top of the door, they kind of just keep shaking around. See, the things you learn when you do weird stuff like this. Never thought that would have happened. You know, I feel like the frames are coming back to us. Look at this, we're up to nine. Oh, uh, there's seven. Yeah, that's better than one. I mean, what even happened here? <laughs> so on the plus side, we've got some decent floral scents going on. Look at that, it's, uh, it's combating the slime lung pretty good. Not to mention the uh, drastic switch to oxygen. Pretty good stuff. We've passed the halfway mark. So things are just starting to get interesting now. Aha! We finally got past cycle 37. It took three t attempts. <laughs> Ooh, somebody finally got to the food up there. That might be why there's a little bit of food left over. Nice. You can get out. I can see it. Figure it out. Oh, no. Liam! No! I, uh, my money was on you, bud. But it didn't work out. Oh wait, there's another, there's a lot of Liams. So no one duplicate has figured out if it destroys the correct tile, like a door, they could get into all of this delicious food. Well, maybe not that food, or that food. Maybe this food right down here. Here, I'll give them a chance at some food over here. Maybe. They gotta get in and get out before somebody digs the bottom tile out. You know what? It would make it more possible for them to dig this stuff out is if I prioritized every four tiles a little bit higher and then left one uh, a little bit lower. Of course, that's going to take a lot of time to set up, so... I guess the only thing I... I all I have is time, right? All right, so it's probably hard to see here, but I went with five and six and five and six and five and six, trying to at least encourage the duplicates to dig sideways. And it looks like it is working out. And because of that, they'll probably die. But let's see what happens. At least this way, they'll get a chance at finding some food. Otherwise, you know, they're just not gonna make it. And to be fair, I don't think they're gonna make it to begin with. We're just gonna make the schedule full work, by the way. Just 100% work. Oh, they keep breaking the electric grill. That is kind of a problem. Let's see if I can give them another one. See, they do have frost buns and they got barbecue that they can make. Mmm, they don't have power as well, so... Hold up, we'll give them a chance here. Mmm, we're down to 25. Ah, but there is some cooking going on. A little bit of food was made. You gotta, you gotta make the food faster than we can destroy the grill. <laughs> oh man. Jeez, oh, every time the grill pops up, somebody tries to destroy it. This is savage. Absolutely savage. Come on now. Okay, there's just a few dust caps down here. We're going to enable that door. Let's see what happens. We'll increase the rewards for those who have lived long enough here. That's not much food. That's not gonna be enough for all of them. So let's find out what happens here. Ruby died. All sorts of people over there are dead. Yeah, you're not dead. Oh, another clone. Hmm, another clone, another clone. A lot of clones kicked the bucket. Interesting. Oh, there's Ada. I don't even know where you went. You're just gone. Okay, so yeah, Super Meep destroys the electric grill and repairs it at the same time. But then they ultimately leave it completely destroyed, so there's that. Okay, so let's take a look at the reports here. The previous cycle, we got 1,200 done again. 1,000, 1,000, 1,200. Hmm. I feel like there's only so many things we can queue up in a single cycle and get done, regardless of how many duplicates you have. 
And look at all the missing cots. Oh. oh, buddy, you are in the wrong spot. Yep. He tried so hard, he dug so far, but in the end, it didn't really matter. Sorry, bud. No, guys, you can't dig that. No, stop trying. Oh, man, I feel like that alone has killed several duplicates. <sighs> All right, well, I need to get to bed, so I'm just going to let this run all night. We'll see if anybody survives all the way till I get up in the morning. Well, good morning. I got bad news for you. Everybody died. But who was the last to go? Hmm. Okay, so if we take a look at the reports here, we can see who was moving on what cycle here. So clone of Meepgar, he was our ultimate survivor. We don't know which one he was. But he was. So he made it to cycle 60. All by himself, just doing a little bit of digging, a little bit of building. And definitely took a shower twice. Wow, that, that's pretty nice. He survived for several cycles before anybody else was alive. So, wow. Okay, actually quite a long time. So it wasn't until cycle 50 that he had a friend, and that was Rowan. So those two were together. In third place is Bonnie. And then it looks like Super Meep ah, was so close to the podium, but only came in fourth place. Just goes to show, all the skills in the world won't keep you alive if you don't have enough food. Of course, then again, I don't even know where he died. So, yeah, good luck. So is that it? The end of the story? Everybody dies? Well, no, because the idea was to get down to a reasonable number of duplicates, and I took a good image of that before I went to bed. And as it turns out, we've got nearly an even number of the clone meeps as compared to the patron meeps. So this just became a build-off battle. The clone army will fight on the right, and the patron meeps will fight on the left. To the victors go the sun. Next time, in Super Duplicates. I'll see you there. So if you don't want to miss that, consider hitting that subscribe button down there. And if you guys are still looking for more stuff, there's probably going to be like a video right here or maybe uh, a video over there. And it would make me really happy if you clicked on one of those. Thanks for watching. Brothgar out.